Hi, my name is Sirjan and I will explain you today Celsius EC, a brand new tool which joined to the Celsius Thermal family at Cadence. Cadence acquired the company mm -hmm. Future Facility and Celsius EC is basically Six Sigma ET solution for future facilities that we successfully integrated in the Celsius product family. So here you can see the results from the Celsius EC CFD simulation, including board and in the mechanical enclosure, chassis and board is over the screws uh, connected to the um, uh, chassis. And uh, in order to come to this uh, point, I will start with the Celsius simulation because there we have prepared everything what is needed for the Celsius EC analysis. And that's the reason that I will start here with the analysis of the board itself, where I can do electrical and thermal uh, analysis on the um, ST Microelectronics Evaluation Board. Here you can see um, uh, motor drive chips, you can see uh, three phases and MOSFETs sitting on those three phases. And I can look, for example, at the MOSFETs uh, via current. So here you can see uh, the via current for each and every via. You can take a look at the current density here. So you can um, definitely look at the current flow so, um, uh, and the hotspots. So if I show vectors, I can see the current flow over there. And in addition to that, I can look at the temperature uh, distribution for each and every layer. So you can see uh, through the layer, I can uh, uh, scroll and see a temperature distribution. So when I'm satisfied uh, with the design, so with the board analysis, electrically and thermally, so I can prepare everything what, uh, for the Celsius EC analysis. So I'm just uh, going to the simulation, set up thermal simulation. And then here you can see, I'm saying generate automatically CFD model. So it will be 10 by 10 uh, divided. So on the, uh, on, the, on the board level and generate PCB layer based simplified model. And that's the model that I will use in the Celsius EC when I start here. So with a um, uh, mechanical enclosure, with the chassis, in order to import this board, I just need to go to Celsius Simplified to the double click and import the board and then push the board down to these um, mechanical screws and to connect it uh, to the chassis. So when I'm going here uh, to the results over there, so you can see the mesh, so you can see a temperature distribution um, uh, in the spatial distribution here and inside of the chassis. You can see also what is the leaking out of the chassis uh, and uh, then you can focus and say, I would like to see here uh, at the PCB level, temperature distribution. And in addition to that, what you can do, uh, you can export these data. So export and then Celsius terminal data, you will be able to export them as a CFD file. And in the CFD file, you will have a uh, description of all heat transfer coefficients, um, uh, which are used here in the simulation. And this will be used in Celsius TD, 2D and 3D as a boundary conditions for the finite element thermal analysis. If you want to learn more about this solution, please look at our website. Thank you.